So I'm going to create an installer. I'm just going to put my USB in there. I've already done this once and it worked. I rescued this computer. So I'm just going to wait for that to come up. I'll get create bootable installer. Mac. Basically, I was going to delete this because I've already done it once and it's got the name on it already. So I'll go to this utility. In fact, I'm going to put this out here so I don't have to keep looking in here for it. So we're going to raise it and make sure it's Mac OS extended. I've already downloaded the uh, the actual ISO image or whatever it is. It's an application. There's the installer. You can click on that and install it onto this, but obviously you want a bootable one on a USB. So you've downloaded it to this folder, Applications. That's important it's in Applications because this command links to Applications. So choose your one, Holy Sierra for me. Scoop it all up. So that's done. I'm just going to rename that though because it wouldn't be called that, it would probably be untitled. So, paste what you just put in to your terminal. Well, as you can see, this end piece is where your USB path is, and it's called two different things. So, delete that. Right click on the USB, copy and paste the path to it. That's it. Press enter. Type in your password. It's going to erase the disk and then create the installer. So you go, it takes about 20 or 30 minutes, so be patient. Well, it does work, I've just done it myself, so I know it works.